Alright, welcome back to Dishonored. Uh, in the last part, we escaped prison. And, uh, hid bodies. Which is basically what we're gonna do for the majority of the game. Hide bodies. But anyways, let's continue. Hidden allies. Hidden in an ode bar on the river. You... Let me start over. Hidden in an... Uh, sorry. I always get nervous when I start recording. You know what, screw this. I'm not, not gonna risk messing up a third time. This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose and he don't know a thing. Yeah, the Houndfits pub is where they hold dogfights. The watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. I'm sure he is. Well, I mean, he already was, but... Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the world. Now he has a good reason to. The Admiral's to. a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. Samuel Beechworth. I expect they're hard at work. I never learned his last name. Throughout all the times I've played this, never learned his last name. There. Best join them. They'll help you get whoever really killed the Empress. He's the only one here that's actually a really good person. Well, I guess there's also, uh, Calista, but that's pretty much it. So it's starting at last. And the basic workers. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. Oh, this I doubt that. a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with him. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered, but before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times. But his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Alright, uh, I'm gonna show something off here. Yeah, if, uh, you start killing people in the Hound Pits pub, uh, you get a game over. So yeah, do not hurt anyone in the Hound Pits pub. Ever. Well, if I say anything else, it will be spoilers. For those of you who haven't uh, actually played the game or seen it, so yeah. I really like the art style of this game, despite all the characters looking like uh, they took a, a sledgehammer to the face half the time. Good to have you with us, Gore. I mean, Nothing that guy. The others, uh, there's no substitute that's for a man face only a mother could love right there. Around. I 
e Piero. Clearly just did happen. Oh yeah, we are definitely not reading this. Anything in here we can steal? No. Risking that to put in our journal. So I can read later. The Academy teaches that absurd idea that the Oh, didn't mean to turn that off. I meant to drop this. The Academy teaches that absurd idea that the energy in whale oil arises from the need to maintain life functions at extreme ocean depths. The pressure in the cold are too much to endure without it. I speculate that a human being might, by a process of adaptation, produce high-energy humors in the body. I could build a tank that would slowly increase pressure on a subject over a long period of time and then observe them for years if need be to see if the formulation of energetic substances develop. Surely the Empress would be able to furnish me with facilities, subject and Yeah, that was him talking about an, an uh, alternative energy source to whale oil. Perfect. Now plug it in. Which never happened Just since Empress it. was assassinated. Perfect. Thank you, Cole. Here, see? The assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face, but this mask will lead you terror. Oh, uh, no one's gonna see me, so I really doubt it. There. Can you see normally? out of the line. There. Better now? I could create... Not really. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Uh, yeah. We're gonna see what, what we can buy. First of all, sleep darts. And two rewire tools. Alright, uh, we're gonna get the combat sleep dart. And uh, that was really stupid of me because I meant to go with crossbow reload. You must be awesome. I advise that you get Oh well, get I'm not going about the reloading. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. I'm gonna see what Very I can well. seal first. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more. Any valuables in here? Uh, that's, uh, where they make the beer for this place. Yeah, as I said earlier, this is where they hold dogfights, but you cannot watch any. Which I am happy about. Over there, Samuel. Who are you? Hi. You must be Corvo. I'm Lydia. At your service. Your room is upstairs and ready. When they told me who it was, well, I thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. Yeah, this is the song that, uh, that they whistle constantly. Is the man... Yes, very...
Nothing else for us to steal in there. This is Admiral Hackett's room. But not Hackett, I mean, uh. Have lock. I log entry 1 4. It seems we have moved to a new phase. Martin's improvisations have been. fruit. And the former bodyguard has been freed and is en route to the staging location. Pendleton's voting block and my military connections. All we've lacked is the ability to project lethal force in a controlled manner against a previously inaccessible. Ah, to the point, we need a man who can kill the bastards for us. Corvo is more than capable of that, I have no doubt. End law. Is this off? Switch. Switch, where the hell is that? Yeah, I think that was his first time trying to record using that. Oh. Someone's in here. My furnishings have been installed at last with no small amount of complaining by that antiquated boatman. The others have no idea what it's like to suffer as I have. Speaking of which... Wallace! Please breathe two bottles of Dunwall Red, never mind which, and fetch a clean glass. <sighs> well... I'll begin again tomorrow. You want to turn around? You know, just for a split second. Pleased to meet you, Master Corvo. I saw you at court in happier days, but you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Hiram Burroughs, back when he was just the spy master. He's one manipulative bastard, I can tell you that. Yeah, we'll just take that. Uh, later. Home sweet home. Sort of. We could have at least dusted a little bit before having me, uh, sleep here. Not gonna lie. All right, let's sleep. Oh, I uh, wasn't paying attention to the screen there. We are somewhere else now. Now, as we saw earlier, there was a door this way, but now it is blocked off. I wonder why. That's why. We're in the void now. Yeah, this is void. Bunch of random stuff. Upside down waterfalls. Floating rocks. Hello, Corvo. What's up? Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world. Great forces that many call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power. My gift to you. Thanks. Come find me. 
That was the outsider. The only person in this game that does not look like they took a buzz to the face. Other than us, of course. You cannot save her, you cannot save her, you cannot save her, you cannot save her, you cannot save her. As you can see, Corvo blames himself. Now, this is the uh, introduction to Blink. Every time you use Blink, you're gonna wanna wait uh, for it to regenerate, because it auto regenerates every time you use it. For uh, this and uh, the one that lets you see through walls and stuff. Corvo, I am very sad. I am so sad. I am very, very sad. You say that you're dead like mother, but I'm going to put this note in a bottle and throw it into the river because I do not believe them. Living here is strange. I do not like it, so please come for me if you can. See these guys? Yeah, they're going to regret that. Here's another one of Piero's spiritual remedies, which replenish mana and not health. Here's Lord, Re Lord Regent. And uh, here is a map of Denmall, which I have never studied and never will, because it's pointless. Those are tall boys, which are basically uh, guys on silts who shoot missiles at people. Like these people. You can't take this and stop it from happening, so that's it. Another upside down waterfall. Good to know. In the days that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. I'm sure they Seek will. The ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this. The heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. This place is the end of all Yeah, this heart basically tells us what people are like. And shows us where runes and bone chimes are. Which is good for us. All of time's meaning is here. Neither seconds, nor centuries. And this building is like this. Someday, this place will devour all the lights in the sky. Oh, that's depressing. Uh, we have four. I have those, uh, things now. Just gonna wait for this to repeat. And... Pick up the room. Our first room. Runes are used to upgrade your spells, well, uh, powers, and uh, making you run faster, stuff like that. Yeah, there's Stark Vision, which is the most useful perk in the game, next to Blink. Personally, I'd rather have Dark Vision than Blink, because, yeah, 
I really like dark vision. Uh, you can increase your health, uh, you can make it where you trigger brutal melee fatalities, but we're not gonna do that. Agility, which is useful, so you don't have to use blink all the time. Shadow kill, which is not useful to us, since we're gonna try to avoid killing as many people as possible. Wind blast, which is for knocking down doors, useful, to, useless to us. Devouring swarm, eh, I don't know if I'm gonna get that yet. Possession and bend time. These four per, these four uh, powers are basically all we're gonna use. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest. Oh, I'm sure you will. 